Hey, YouTube friends and family. How's everybody doing? I hope all of you are doing well and faring as best as you can. It's not easy times. We have a lot going on. You know, I wanted to get on here and share just my insight. You know, I expected, absolutely expected, to enjoy my children when I became a mother. I expected the loose teeth and the fun with the tooth fairy. I expected the childhood chicken pox and the possibility of measles that we tried so hard to avoid. I expected the first grade fear and the clinging on to me when I had to leave them there at school. I expected that. I expected the aging wrinkles, the graying of my hair, and all the things that come in time. But there's no way that I could have expected some of the traumas in my life. I never would have thought that I would lose the father of my children at such a young age. But I did. I never thought that I would remarry only to have a husband that would have a stroke and become a different person. But that happened too. Things in life that we just don't expect. I read the news, I watch the weather, but I didn't expect the freeze that we got the other night. Sometimes I don't expect the rain, but it comes. I certainly expected to be a good citizen and to do my best in the community, helping other people. I expected to do that. I expected of myself the best that I could be. I expected that once I was of age, it was my duty to vote. I expected to do that. And quite frankly, I looked forward to it. Many times I've looked forward to voting. But not this time. I don't look forward to it at all. I expected to be a good citizen. But I didn't expect a lousy government. I didn't expect all the corruption that we see today. I didn't expect to worry about things that should never be in front of us. Worrying about work in our country, a country that is so vast and so big and so powerful, where jobs could be created everywhere. I didn't expect that they would take jobs away from good people and send them overseas. I didn't expect that. I didn't expect my neighbors to be faced with foreclosure and kicked out of their home. I didn't expect that. The expected, the unexpected. Today, more unexpected is taking place day after day than what we expect. In fact, I expect to go to the store to buy my groceries every two weeks, only to find that the prices have raised again. I expected to read in the news that 
Bill Gates was now putting out GMO eggs. I expected that. And that's why I have my own hens. I expect that he'll poison everything that he can. Anything that isn't good for the human being. After all, he has verbalized his contempt for the population and his goal to help depopulate. He said it verbally. So that's an expected. It certainly is. Thing is, I wouldn't expect my mom and pop grocer, grocer to stock those eggs. The GMO fake goo eggs. But will it matter? After all, they're putting those eggs in other foods. Yeah. We've come to a time when we just don't know what to expect. We really don't. Fear is being built up over this Ebola and the mishandling, the poor judgment, the bad choices that people who should know are making. So do we expect good or do we expect bad? I don't know what to expect. But I'm making this video because I expect to reach out to many good people. And I'm asking you now to stop and think about what you expect. What is it you expect? The only way we can get what we want and to fix this mess is to expect more of ourselves. Do you understand that? We must not accept what they're doing. We must not accept what they're doing. It is time to dissolve both parties. Neither one of them is worth a blank. I wish you all the very best. And I expect you to leave a comment down below. And tell me what you expect. And what you don't expect. Because quite frankly, friends and family... What we're seeing today is more of what we don't expect and hardly anything of what we would expect in a country that we've been so loyal to. Enough is enough. Happy Halloween. What do you expect? Oh, a hug. Well, great big hugs and a whole bunch of love. I'll catch you guys later.